Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has, quietly behind the scenes, updated Windows 11's minimum processor requirements for Copilot AI-powered PCs. So, as you may well know, Microsoft has been packing new AI features into Copilot Plus PCs because every update that has rolled out recently for Windows 11 24H2, as I have been talking about on the channel, most of the new features are for Copilot Plus PCs. So because of all these new AI-powered features that Microsoft is now packing into Copilot Plus PCs, they are now going to need more than just a compatible CPU. Now Microsoft has this officially to say, and I'm quoting, Copilot Plus PCs are a new class of Windows 11 AI PCs that are powered by a turbocharged neural processing unit, NPU for short, a specialized computer chip for AI-intensive processes like real-time translations and image generation that can perform more than 40 trillion operations per second, also known as TOPS, T-O-P-S. Now, just on a side note in regards to all the new AI features that Microsoft is rolling out, I posted a video late last week, AI in Windows 11, bloat or not, some thoughts. I'll leave that link down below and in the end screen because it kind of ties into what we're talking about um, in this video. Microsoft carries on to say from the announcement for the new hardware requirements, to run unique Copilot Plus PC experiences, customers will need to acquire new hardware. Now that's also been met with a lot of debate where Microsoft wants you to go out and buy a new PC, especially if you are still running Windows 10 and cannot upgrade to Windows 11. I've also posted on that. I'll leave that video linked as well. Now over and above that, Microsoft carries on to say, in addition to the minimum system requirements for Windows 11, Copilot Plus PCs must include the following. So if we head to the Windows 11 specs and system requirements, yeah, at the bottom of the page, Microsoft says, a compatible processor or system on a chip with a MPU capable of performing 40 plus tops. This currently includes AMD Ryzen AR300 series, Intel Core Ultra 200V series and the Snapdragon X series. And then you need 16 gigabytes of DDR5 or LPDDR5 RAM and a minimum storage of 256 gigabyte SSD or UFS. And it seems that because of all these new features, as mentioned, that Microsoft is packing into Copilot Plus PCs on Windows 11 24H2, that the hardware requirements are just getting steeper and steeper. And I don't know where this is all going to end. But on the flip side of the coin, if you are running a Copilot Plus PC or are wanting to get your hands on a Copilot Plus PC, then it's not just Qualcomm Snapdragon X series processes now. We also have AMD and Intel that's supported. So that's at least if you find yourself in that bracket and move in the right direction. But just putting it out there in case you would be interested. And it does tie in with that other video. So go check it out as mentioned. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.